What's going on you guys? This is Andrew Roboto 2021 here and welcome to Five Nights at Nintendo Land Anniversary Edition where this is the anniversary edition of the original Five Nights at Nintendo Land which was originally created by Frosties and it was released in 2015 but um, this anniversary edition is created by NL, NL Pikachu, which um, it was just released this year, and it's actually one of the Nintendo Land fan games I've been coming across on Games Old. The one made by Frosties was taken down about a year or two ago from Games Old. No, it actually a few years ago from Games Old, but then in 2020, a user re uploaded it, and which I don't remember his name, but I did play the original game in 2020. Because I was gonna, because I couldn't do it before, because it wasn't on games until 2020 after its takedown. So yeah. But anyways, this is the anniversary edition, and it's to celebrate the anniversary of its release in 2015. Because believe it or not, Final Fantasy Nintendo Land is. I'm trying to. I gotta count how old it is. Final Fantasy Nintendo Land is. Eight years old now, so this is to celebrate the eight year anniversary. So, yeah, and as you can see, the main menu Sam's got a Mario in a black outfit and he's standing in the rain. The piano theme is the same, I remember the piano theme. So, yeah, press one for full screen, it says. There we go, okay. I actually forgot you could press it on full screen. I do apologize because I had my camera zoomed in when it was on minimize. I didn't know you could put it on full. I forgot you could put it on full screen. I do apologize for that. But yeah. But anyways, without further ado, we'll start a new game. Let's see what's the offer for us. And now I gotta raise the brightness because it is. Since we are outside in the cold, like in the original game. Hey man, how's it going? I and. Okay. Okay, so the phone call is the same, cameras are the same. The camera's a Wii, a Wii U gamepad, interesting. Okay. Phone call is the same, the camera... The cameras are the, the the Wii U gamepad. I don't remember that being in the original. In fact, in the original it was an iPad, I think. But in this one, it's a Wii U gamepad. That's pretty cool, actually. Okay, so the mechanics are pretty much the same. We got to look for Pikachu, Meta Knight, and Luigi. And then I remember Sonic's mechanic. For Sonic, you have to walk the door using your camera. And that's the only time you really actually have to use the camera is for Sonic. One thing I'm noticing that's different is, is that... Um, oh, here's Pikachu. Is that... Um, There's some differences I'm noticing. Instead of using the keypad for to to look in front of you using your flashlight, instead you click on the mouse, and then the camera is different. It's a, it's a Wii U gamepad instead of an iPad. And then another thing that's different is the Majora awareness. Instead of draining, it fills up. And then the brightness, yeah, it's the same mechanic. Hi, Majora. So there you go. I believe Majora is a Pokemon. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I think Majora is a Pokemon. I believe he is. Because I know Pikachu is. And like I said earlier, you're in the same location. We're outside in the rain in front of the entrance. And you have a shack to hide in from Pikachu, Meta Knight, and Luigi. And I'm going to say this just like I did in the original video. You could have at least gave me a shed. You could have at least gave me... 
gave me a building to stay warm inside because, trust me, I, I'm going to get pneumonia being outside in this frigid cold weather. In fact, you would get pneumonia if you were standing outside in this game in real life and, and it was like raining and frigid cold. And just like the original game, the nights are fast. And it has a password, just like the original game. So I gotta write that down. Night 2 password is 100111101011. Okay. Just like the original game, and this, and just like with Final Fantasy at Smudgers, the first game, Final Fantasy Smudgers 1, as well as Final Fantasy Smash Bros. games. And then Final Fantasy Wario's, um, trying to remember what the game is called. There's a Final Fantasy Wario's game that requires passcodes too. Passwords too. I believe it's Final Fantasy Wario's, like, um, I believe it's like Final Fantasy Wario's Revisit or something. I don't know. I don't remember the name of it, but it's a Final Fantasy Wario's game. I'll look back at my videos after I'm done recording this because. Because I know I did a Let's Play on that. On the first and second game. I gotta make sure I get the password. At least it's giving me time to write it down. It's not like the screen is not... Because in the original game, the screen only was there for a few minutes. And, I had, and you had to like write it down real quickly before it just went back to the main menu. Because in the original game, I had to take the picture with my phone. Because the screen didn't because the password screen didn't show for a long time. Like, it only showed for like 10 seconds and it disappeared. But thankfully, I had enough time to write it down in my notebook. Which I'm checking to make sure I have it. 1001101 011. Okay, perfect. And now we can jump into night two. And for night one, only one we got was Pikachu, so yeah. On to night two, we enter the password. Okay. I hope I got it right. Let me look at my notebook. One zero zero one 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 zero one zero one one. All right. I got the password right for night two. Perfect. And we get a phone call again. Okay, and I remember Meta Knight's mechanics, so for Met Oh Okay, so for Meta Knight you have to go in the shack when you hear Russ him rustling through the bushes. R or ruffling through the bushes. So yeah, and then Pikachu either comes on the left or right side. So yeah, so same mechanics. And then Luigi pretty much comes the same way as Pikachu. Sonic has a sound cue, which is him spinning, and that's when you gotta walk, walk the door. And what's interesting about this game... Oh, gotta go to the back, Meta Knight. Don't want the Majora awareness getting full. Because in the original Finance and Nintendo Land game, the Majora awareness drained. And if it ran out, then Majora would kill you. But in this game, it fills up.
Oh, Mennonite. Jesus! How did Mennonite kill me? I went in the shack. Great, now I gotta enter the password again. Bear with me, I'm looking forward to my notebook. Because I know I wrote it down in my notebook. I just gotta look at what page it's on. Because I've written other stuff in this notebook. Um, let's see, where is it? There it is, found it. Oh, I entered the wrong password. I'm missing the number, that's what. So it's one zero zero K. Oops, yeah, I'm I'm messing up the password. There we go, okay. Sorry, I I put the wrong number in by accident. Cause I was trying to figure out the password and I put the wrong number in. Okay, so let's try it again. I don't know how Meta and I killed me. I, I hid in the shack when I heard him ruffling through the bushes. I probably didn't go in in time. That's probably why. Oh, Pikachu and Meta Knight here, so I gotta go to the back. Jesus. Oh, wait a minute. And just like the original game, the, the game over screen shows Mario being hanged. I think that's the player stuffed in a Mario suit and then hangs. I think that would make more sense. Okay. All right. I just remembered how to deal with Meta. You gotta, you gotta flash the light at him when he's ruffling through the bushes, then go hide. Okay. I apparently forgot his mechanic because Meta Knight's tricky to deal with. So for Meta Knight, we gotta flash the light at him. I think then hide in the bushes. I think that's what you do with Meta Knight, cause, or you just hide in the shack right away, cause Meta Knight is annoying. I think that's what you do with Meta Knight. You either flash your light when you hear him ruffling, then go in the shack, or you just go in right away. I don't know, because Meta Knight's annoying to deal with. Pikachu. Ah! 
And I didn't deal with Meta Knight in time. Great. God, because I was dealing with Pikachu. God. Oh my god. The double team. I hate being double teamed in early nights. It's terrible. It's even worse than later nights. The teaming. I remember how to deal with Meta Knight, though. I just gotta flash the white and then go in the shack. God, because Meta Knight's tricky to deal with. Did I get rid of Meta Knight? I hope I did. Okay, good. I got rid of Meta Knight. Good. God, because Meta Knight is just annoying. And I got rid of Pikachu, thank God. Because Meta Knight's already killed me 30 times in this video. Because... The timing for him is just terrible. And it's also annoying at the same time. Okay, dealt with Meta Knight, now I'm dealing with Pikachu. There we go. Got rid of both of them. So at least I figured out what to do with them when I'm being double teamed. If Meta Knight comes first, deal and then Pikachu, we'll deal with Meta Knight first, then Pikachu. And then Luigi will figure out for night three for how to deal with him if we're being double or triple teamed. Okay, now I gotta go to the shack because Pikachu's here. And I just got rid of Meta Knight, so that's good. There we go. So we got rid of Meta Knight. Perfect. God. Yeah, I cannot believe I forgot about Meta Knight's mechanic. Well, I forgot part of it. I only remember... The only part of it I remember at first was going in the shack. I forgot you had to flash the light at him to get rid of him, then go in the shack. God. In fact, that's why Meta Knight's so annoying. Okay, now I gotta do a Pikachu. There you go. Got rid of Pikachu and Meta Knight, so that's good. Thankfully, the Knights are fast in this game, like in the original. That's what I like about FNAF fan games when they have fast Knights. And we beat Knight 2, alright. A little tricky because of Meta Knight, but we, f and, but we, f we figured it out, so. We beat it nonetheless. Still can't believe I forgot part of Meta Knight's mechanic. <laughs> okay, but anyways. Now I gotta write down the Knight 3 password. Okay, so the password for Knight 3 is, let's see. The passwords are pretty much the same as in the original game, because these numbers are all familiar. Okay, zero, 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 zero. So four zeros 
and then one one zero one zero zero one all right there we go wrote down the password all right so we will take on night three in the next video nights three and four in the next video since these are fast nights thank you for watching everybody please hit the like button also comment and subscribe i appreciate all the support you have given me hit the bell to receive all notifications of upcoming videos on my channel go follow me on tiktok and be sure to to hit the bell to receive all notifications of upcoming videos on there as well and I will see you in the next video. Goodbye.